Welcome everyone, here's how you add borders to photos in iPhone. So the first way I'll cover is adding your regular photo and having white borders, black borders, etc. The second method is let's say you have a picture of yourself. Uh, we're going to remove the background, then we're going to add a border around our face, okay, whatever color you want. So the first step is if we're going to add a border to the general picture, you're going to download a Fonto app. This is free from the App Store. You're then going to open it up. You're then going to tap on the camera icon. You're going to tap on plain images. You're going to tap on the white here. If you want to change the color, you can change the color by tapping on this. If you want to change the resolution, you can change this as well. Do note the aspect ratios here. So in my case, I'm going to use a four by three. And once I'm good to go, I'm going to tap on the share and then I'm going to tap on use. From here, you're going to tap on the triple lines, add image, you're going to add the image in question, let's say this one, and I'm going to tap on done. Now from here, I'm going to tap on the image, I'm going to tap on move, I'm going to tap on the center buttons here, I'm going to tap on size, and now I'm going to increase the size. So you have these fine controls here, that looks almost there, increase it a little bit more, and you can see we now have the white borders and the regular image. Of course, depending on the aspect ratio or the background, the borders will be on the side or top and bottom. Okay, so now when we're good to go, we're going to tap on the share icon. We're going to find save image. Okay, now when we open up the photos app, I'm going to have to blow all that stuff out, but you're going to see here this white border. Okay, now what if you have a face and you just want to add a border around your face? So here is the deal. Uh, let's go to let's say the photos app the easiest way you could do is tap on edit here and then you're going to tap on markup like so and then you use one of these pens and you can zoom in let's just rub this stuff out make sure you tap on the eraser and set this to pixel eraser and you just go across finally okay going across obviously you're going to spend time on it unlike me who's just doing a, a 10 second job here go around boom and you're going to be good to go now you may want to maybe add text to the background so maybe you have this foreground object here you want to add text and then you have the background so to separate that you want to download another app called magic eraser again free from the app store it does have this annoying pop-up but you can close out of these ads like so so what we're going to do is we're going to tap on the skip video like so x and we're just going to select the photo in question done and you just tap on the magic button use the slider to change the sensitivity so it seems like we need to erase so you just erase all the way around so you just have the foreground in play okay you tap on share save then you'd open up the fonto app you're going to open up a new project okay so i did a little bit fast step on the camera photo albums you're going to put in the backgrounds the one which has everything default like so you're then going to tap on the triple lines add image you're then going to add the image which has the back uh, the background removed you're going to tap on this move move to the center increase until it looks perfect does that look good i think that looks good then you can tap on the empty space, add text, and you can interlace it between the two. Let's see. And um, yeah, so let's see here. We'll go like this. 